hi guys welcome back to enigma 77 reviews so today we have the long awaited hey maiden yes I've got it right this time guys so this is my second attempt of filming Moon Maiden the first time it wasn't Moon Maiden it was a completely different company my bad I got way too excited but I am genuinely excited about this one so it's arrived I did get a notification from um, Sarah that this had already been sent off and recorded and so forth and I didn't think it'd be here today to be honest with you guys I thought oh maybe another day maybe Tuesday I'll see it rather than seeing it today but it's arrived today and I'm super super happy it's come in this gold I should have remembered from Mama Goth when she had hers it's extremely heavy um, which I'm happy about but I think I'll just quickly update you guys on the competition. It has been postponed now until 2021. A part of me is relieved, a part of me is gutted. Um, one, because I have worked my ass off to get everything I need for this competition in time for the competition. Two, I'm hoping the original people that are going can still make it for them dates, I'm praying. Um, but I'm relieved because of the COVID situation. Um, I don't particularly want to be sat in a room amongst a lot of people when there's such virus lurking around everyone. Um, it just puts me off a little bit and it doesn't reassure me. So let's get stuck in, guys, to today's video, which is Moon Maiden. So what do I know about Moon Maiden? It opened in 2003. I know that my friend Gail had her wedding dress made by the lovely Moon Maiden. I didn't actually know that until, and her dress was absolutely stunning, may I add, I have seen her wedding dress, stunning. Um, I did actually ask my friend about when she had her wedding dress made and so forth, and she's not got back to me yet, and it's time to get this video done but I do know it opened in 2003 so obviously but she said her dress was amazing and she reassured me that Moon Maiden was 100% like true they were legit they were a really good company and I was paying in installments for mine because I just don't have that kind of money to pay for everything in one go obviously now because I've not got anything else to buy I could buy something straight off from Sarah but because I had so many things to buy I couldn't do that so let's just put my glasses on and read some notes that I have jotted down guys so mission to make the world a more beautiful place is one of Sarah and Michael's quotes and they really do I love their videos they they do have a YouTube channel they do advertise their clothing on there every now and again the setting is beautiful they do come from Cornwall so you can imagine how beautiful the scenery is around there and they really do capture the theme of the the dresses that they're making so what kind of dresses do they make so they do make a lot of medieval gowns like i say they set the scene in everything that they make they always set the scene even to the photography now i know that sarah designs makes and she models all her own clothing and michael does all the photography i think they work beautifully in harmony as a team and i just think they're both absolutely amazing if you go on there, you will just be astounded at the amount of items they have on there to say that they do everything themselves. The material, the lot, the, everything's made from scratch. I think they do pre-make some things, which they'll put sizes on there, but a lot of the things they will do is made to measure. So it is vital that when you do go on audio clothing, you give them a correct measurement, or if you want to just slightly add a few um, inches on there, you can do so it's easier to take clothes in than it is to add on so i don't know if these are going to fit me now guys because it's been a while since i i ordered them and i have gained a lot of weight since then so chances are they might not fit me at the moment but knowing that i've got till next year now just gives me a bit of relief if they don't fit me i will fit in them my fringe is curling under it guys it's super warm in here today so they make medieval gowns, they do Wiccan, they do corsets, ultra soft skirts, short skirts, long skirts, they do leggings as well guys. They do all kinds of cosplay, so gothic culture, fairy, renaissance, steampunk and Wiccan, Halloween 
even Viking guys. She'll even make me a Viking outfit. I'm trying to get some ideas together and I'm going to ask Sarah to make me a Viking outfit. It's not for like the competition or anything. It's just for something that I want to do on my channel and I want to set the actual theme for it somehow. <laughs> um, so let me talk a little bit more. In 2009, they won an Alternative Fashion Magazine UK Designer of the Year Award. Well done, you two. 59,364 likes. It says it all. That just to me says it all. So from there, they were based in Cornwall. They design and make and sell exclusive range of gothic clothing. They ship worldwide. Anything worldwide they do charge for. But anything in the new in the UK, in the UK, in the UK is free, which I thought was really, really good as well. Um, the made to measure, which I've said at no extra cost, so guys. If you want to change your measurements now i could have said oh i've gained a bit of weight can you add can i change it but i didn't want to because it's not the way i want to be without my competition so i'm happy to get them the size i did and if they do need taken in it's easier to take them in than it is to like i said add material on um, and you won't find anywhere else that does these unique custom piece custom pieces i will stick a few pictures up so you get to see what the amazing sarah and michael actually do I just think everything about their presence is amazing. I mean, I'm just besotted by the whole company and I know that a lot of people will feel and agree with me that Moon Maiden is simply the best. So guys, that is what I found out so far about them. The shop's always open. They do have a lookbook as well, guys. So if you're not sure of what you want to buy and you just want some general ideas, if you go on to their actual page, I will link everything in the description box below. So you can go and check out the YouTube page, their business page, their Facebook page. They are everywhere and I'm happy because I can just like put their links everyone and no matter if you ain't got that platform you can go look at it at that platform so she's got a custom look book as well so you can go and have a look i have picked from the their actual page i've not gone to her with my own ideas i have picked their actual clothing i did think afterwards that i could have actually thought a little bit out of the box and got them to make my actual outfit uh, but to be honest with you it's the first time i've done anything like this and first time I've done a competition so if it goes well I can always blooming go back to Sarah and get something else made just before the competition totally blown away by these and I'm quite happy with these as you know I've bought corsets as well to go with these hopefully they do match okay guys like I said everything's made to measure um they contact you throughout if you're going to do installments like I do they will contact you you know any questions you've got to ask them, they will reply back to you in their time. Obviously, they are busy making other people's outfits in a time scale. So they will get back to you when they get that spare minute. I think what they do is simply amazing. And I am so goddamn excited to show you what's in here. So let's crack it open, guys. And let's talk about it. Um, I don't know if they've put the items on here. Oh, they have. They have, they have, they have, but they haven't put the prices on there, guys. So if I get the pictures of my outfits, my items, I'll put them up here with the prices so you get to see. Uh, like I said, these are for the alternative competition. And um, yeah, I have changed my mind so many times, guys, with this outfit. First, I was going green and red, and then I went to purple and green, and then I went to red and purple. I just could not make my mind up, guys it was terrible but in the end i just decided just go for this <gasps> oh super excited right guys so they're not bagged up individually so i'm just gonna see if i can just put it here and grab one outfit at a time i don't quite remember either guys which is which so my bad i should have actually wrote them down first oh my lord let's have a look what's in here okay so She's put her lovely card in here as well, which is brilliant. It says unique, spooky and witchy. Definitely. Designed and handmade with magic and love. Keeping it spoofy all year. And then it has www.moonmaiden slash gothic slash clothing dot co dot uk. God, that was a mouthful. And that is the beautiful Sarah there modelling one of her pieces there. 
amazing everything you see like her headdress and her jewelry some jewelry she does have on the shop as well you can buy such thing as like jewelry and like veils and stuff like that some accessories she does do but a lot of her headgear she has told me she has bought elsewhere but she just misses mix matches everything so perfectly even down to the footwear guys amazing i am just besotted by everything <gasps> okay so here's my first outfit oh my god <gasps> so excited no I, she did contact me last week to say she was waiting for the um like fishnet material to come i'm not too sure i think this might be the spookwa top guys no it isn't is it no it's the broom maiden top guys this was made to measure by the way guys so i didn't just pick i did have it made to measure um i can't remember the prices like i said but i will pop it up i'll pop a picture up as well <gasps> Oh my God, guys, that is what I call luxury velvet. Can you see me gleaming? I'm like smiling from ear to ear. So as you can see, I have gone for this top with this. Let me just get it right. Get it right, Rachel. <laughs> so like the sleeves are so long and oh, look at it. So they're all cut. So they have that really jagged, witchy kind of hem at the bottom. That's it, got it. There you go, guys. How beautiful is that? I absolutely love it. And then it's all in velvet, guys, and it is basked at the front here. So just ties at the front here. So you can either loosen it for a bit of cleavage or you can have it out. Now it is basked, guys. So at the front here, let me just put the sleeve over here and put this sleeve here so you get a good image of it. So as you can see, it is basked and boned here. So here, and it goes into a point, so it sits at the hips. So I will be showing a little bit of flesh, but if I lose that way, I'll be all right. And then it sits in a point here, and then it's boned across here and boned across here. It is absolutely beautiful. God knows how she's done that. I mean, if you look, if you look at that, guys, the stitching and everything is just unbelievable. Perfect. I mean, absolutely perfect. And as you can see, it's higher at the back. And then it just sits in a square at the back so it will just sit nicely on the hips and then she's got a little little label here that says moon maiden as you can see here her little logo and there's nothing on here that tells you but it's it's clear to see that this is crushed velvet and fishnet this is just proper quality and it's quite stretchy as well guys so i've got plenty of room in there so that's my first item guys let me just look after it because these are going to have to be put away or is this the skirt? Let me just check. No, this is the next top. Oh, super excited. So this next top, guys, is the um, Spookwa top. And I had this in the amethyst and black mesh. Made to measure again, guys. I'll pop the price up here and a picture of it so you get to see what it looks like on the lovely Sarah. <gasps> OMG, this is absolutely gorgeous. So guys, I'm getting way too excited. So, oh, you bloody talented woman. So hook and eye all the way down and it's in this beautiful amethyst purple and it's in velvet again, guys. Oh, I love this, but guys, this is, the, this is the best bit. So here's the sleeves. <laughs> oh my God. Guys, just look at the sleeves oh my god it looks better in person well no it looks amazing on her but to actually see the actual top in itself i can't believe that they make all the their own clothing it's just purely magical the material is so beautiful luxury it's not a cheap material, this, guys, either. This is not a cheap velvet. This is a proper luxurious velvet. It's quite thick as well. I like the fact it's quite thick, as you can see. And then here is a little Moon Maiden tag as well. Oh, I can't wait to try these on, guys. They will fit me, without a doubt. And I think these, I think it might sit slightly. You can have it slightly off the shoulders or you can have it up onto the shoulders, whatever you decide. Obviously, I'm going to be wearing a bra, but I absolutely love this. So, simple hook and eye, guys. Just pulls out like so and then hooks in. Now, as you know, I have got 
under bust basks to go with these i'm not too sure if i'll wear them yet it depends what they look like on their own and with the bass i may try all on today and see what they all look like but the sleeves are amazing guys look at the length of them sleeves i think it starts like here yeah so it all spreads out oh i can do that whole spooky wadruna thing that i want to do <laughs> i think she read my mind i love this absolutely love it look at that guys oh, so that's my two tops guys so that's that's the two tops of my outfit. It's going to be a really long video, guys. Really, really sorry. But two skirts now. Now, the black skirt is to go with the purple top. Does that make sense? Oh, this material. Wow. So this is the first skirt, guys. So elasticated. Plenty of room for me in there. Absolutely amazing. That will sit beautifully on me. Obviously, I'll be wearing like pulley ups to make my waist thinner. Now, the only thing, if I do lose too much weight, my mother in law will have to try and sort something out. But I doubt I will lose that much weight from now because Christmas comes. We all eat at Christmas and I may gain a few pounds then. Here is the little moon maiden again. So, this is a super, super long skirt, guys. It's it's like it's not an airline it's not a straight skirt it flows out of the bottom it's hard to show you so i'll pop the picture up here so you get to see what it looks like this one this one is the witchy cotton skirt and it's black cotton and lycra and again it is made to measure i've got all the codes for these guys so i'll read that out at the end but let me just stand up so you can just see the length that i've gone for so as you can see it's completely long flowy oh i love it 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 it's gonna look amazing with that purple top as well now it looks big guys to be honest with you but i always think when you measure it's always can you see it's always hip to hip this side to this side so that is perfect absolutely perfect these were all reasonably priced, guys. None of these were too expensive. I, I, I think my whole, my total order came to 160, I think. Oh, let me just pick this up, guys. I've got loads of crap on the floor. I think my whole order came to about 160 pound. Like I said, I paid in instalments. Um, they were both happy for me to do that. <gasps> oh my God. So obviously this is the red one, which goes with the black top. So this one is the taffeta. They did. They did tell me about twice, three times that it's taffeta material. I told her that that's completely fine. I don't mind. I like taffeta material. And it's a Deirdre skirt. This one, again, is made to measure. Every time I see this skirt, I fall in love with it over and over and over again. I just love this skirt so goddamn much. This will be everything for me, this. This will just, just, just do it. Look at this skirt. It is amazing <laughs> i love it so it's got a velvet waistband again i've been made to measure so you've got this waistband here so it sits nicely here on the hips so you get to see the waistband i'm not too sure um because my top comes in at, yeah so my top comes down in a point so obviously you'll get to see the waistband you don't cover up obviously if i wear the basque i don't know how that will fur but we'll have to see it's very very long guys because i have I have said that I'd be wearing quite high boots underneath here, so it will lift me up slightly. So I, she's granted the fact that I've got boots on, but I love this skirt. This is everything. Look at it. So this is a taffeta material. I think the material changed. I think she had a certain material and then she changed it for a different one. <gasps> So guys, I did do my, my makeup purple today. I was torn between red and purple, but I've got red hair, so at least something goes with this skirt. So guys, that is Moon Maiden. <gasps> I know you've been waiting forever to see it, not as long as me. So guys, what I will be doing with these, well, I will be like just giving them a quick eye and a quick press, and then um, my husband's ordering me like um, a hold all 
that just folds in half to take with me for the competition next year. I think now my dad, I will be going to Rochdale first and then my dad will drop me off at the hotel. I don't know. It's all It all goes on who's taking me, um, who's taking me, who's coming with me. Um, I haven't got that sorted yet, but it gives me more time now to sort that out. Okay, so it does give you, if you love your clothes, we'd love a photo for your custom gallery and you can also now leave a review on the new site or sign our guest book, without a doubt. And it has washing instructions. So it says remove ribbons or cording before washing, which is one of them has got ribbons in. Velvet only garments, machine wash at 40 degrees centigrade. Cotton only garments, machine wash at 40 degrees. Garments that contain taffeta, like this one, hand wash only. We only accept returns prior arrangement. Yeah, da 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 da. I'm returning these to you no bloody way so thank you so so much to moon maid and to sarah and michael you have made me a very happy woman today i am gleaming a little bit um let me just check that i've got everything super super heavy garments as well guys got i've got to tell you you can just tell that this is quality 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 um i'll keep that bag it'll come in handy for something else so i'm gonna go and do a try on guys pop a comment on below below rachel below uh, i will also insert in the eye here um the lovely mama goth doing her moon maiden um on opening and you could just see the excitement on her face and it says it all it says it all guys i'm super happy thank you so much moon, ma moon maiden <laughs> and um i will do to the end all right guys see you on the next one Pop your comments on below. I will put everything in the description box below, including these items. But don't you bloody go and buy them for a competition because I don't want to be walking down the blooming catwalk with the same clothing as someone else. That would be a nightmare. <laughs> All right, guys. Take care of yourself. Until the next one. Stay to the end. Bye for now. Outfit number one. I have had to um, put some really <laughs> like big shoes on. I won't be wearing these for the competition because I will break my neck I just put on them velvet ones so this is the taffeta skirt it is massive on me guys and i think what's happened is when i did my measurements i was a lot bigger and i mean around the midriff i was a lot bigger and obviously i've lost a lot of weight around there even though i want to lose more weight i think the skirt will actually fall down if i lose any more weight around there at the minute i've just tied it and you can actually see it but it's only a temporary fix i will show you what this looks like without the basque as well guys but this is the top fits beautifully obviously because it's it's boned itself it's sitting funny though but i will sort all that out um it's just a matter of pulling it underneath pulling it down so it is firmly down but guys oh missing we're missing an item right as you know i actually have my headdress as well so this is what my vision was guys can you see my vision or is it just me i think i think sarah saw my vision absolutely amazing now i i'm not too sure what prop i'm going to have at the minute that's something i'll wait for until nearer the time but i will be having a prop I think I know what kind of prop I'm going to be using. Oh, I love it. This skirt is everything, guys. Now, I could, and it, it is a suggestion that I might do, I might be getting a petticoat underneath it, guys. So I, I might actually not have to worry about it. It may be brought out anyway. So at the minute, it just it's just sat down as it is. The minute I seen this skirt, I absolutely loved it, and I knew I had to have it. It was just, I need that skirt. It's perfect absolutely perfect even if i lose a little bit of weight it'll still fit really nicely on um and i know i ain't gonna gain weight so i know either way i'll just be losing weight but everything fits a beautiful absolutely beautiful this lady is pure talent so you get to see the top on properly so as you can see it goes to a point here now i know sarah has her skirt hanging on her hips so you can actually see the suede there I just pulled it up slightly. I like mine to sit literally just on my waistline. But it is too big, guys. So as you can see at the back, <laughs> I've toggled it. That's only because of me. It's not because of Sarah. It's not 
my measurements were different then. I know, I've lost weight, so that's a good thing, but I need to lose more weight, so that's a bad thing. <laughs> but, like I said, if I can get my mother-in-law to just tack it, that's all I need. I just need it tacking, and then it will be under the bath, so you're not going to see any imperfections or folds or anything like that. But I absolutely love this, guys. I don't know if I'm going to get an underskirt for it or not. What do you think, guys? Pop a comment below. Let me think. Let me tell me if it's fine as it is, or do I need to put an underskirt on it? This top is beautiful. You can wear this with anything, guys. I will probably stick this back on with um, a nice pair of um, velvet trousers, velvet skirt. You could wear anything with this, guys. I'm going to be going back to my maiden and getting a hell of a lot more things. You better know this. Sarah Michael, thank you. So this is my second outfit. Ooh, I love it. I've not put the basque on with it. Um, I'm not I'm not sure if I'll put the mask on with it to do a try on with it. I don't know, we'll see. It takes forever. Um, but guys, let's just let's just take in this. Oh I love it. It's just absolutely. I'm just gonna have to play with these sleeves for a bit to get up like strike a pose. <laughs> yep. Um, they are magnificent as you can see this top is beautiful again plenty of room in it skirt fits a treat guys now exactly the same measurements for the other skirt um, it is big but it sits nicely up on my I'm not gonna lose the skirt and then the top sits nicely on it so obviously the basque is gonna just close it all in together I will show you what it looks like with the basque just to show you but the skirt is lovely, it's it's a lovely length as well. Um, obviously I'm wearing purple shoes with this, not these black ones. I just love this. Can I do this for the photo? Do -do. <laughs> Do -do. <laughs> so this is the purple with the basque. As you can see, it's lovely. He's not done it too tight, but he said whoever's doing your basque on the day will do it tighter for me, so I will pull in and get that hourglass figure. The skirt, is amazing i'm not even going to bother um adjusting the skirt in any way i think it just sits nicely on my hips um the material is absolutely amazing guys this velvet is luxurious now this top is is two in one so you can have it off the shoulders which i think is very very pretty especially if i get my chest tattooed before the contest i think i might say to my brother if i can have my chest done first and then at least this part's done for the competition um, and obviously I'll get my shoulders done another time. I absolutely love the whole aesthetic of this top. I mean, just look at it. It's beautiful. It, I feel like a bat. I just love it. And then if you don't want your arms to fall down in the middle, you can put your arms like here. So through my pictures, I could have, I mean, I've got hand props as well to put on, but that's for the main outfit. I will buy more skirts like this from um, Moo Maiden. They've got a couple of skirts that my wish list is endless. I hope this review um, is good for you people to see that Moo Maiden is such a trustworthy um, shop. They make such beautiful items, guys. This is not, it's like nothing I've ever had. I, I've got to hold my hands up and tell you, I've never had anything like this in my entire life. I know I had my wedding dress, but that, that was a disaster, that wedding dress, we'll all go down there. But having clothes made like this, it's not like Killstar or Disturbia or your usual place where you get your clothing from. This is just out there, it's just amazing. I do want to dip into EXO Umbro soon, that is on my list as well. Um, these people that make these clothes from scratch, their own creations, blows my mind. All right guys, take care of yourself. Please go and check out Moon Maiden. Give Sarah and Michael some lots of love to spooky love. Sarah is on Facebook, so you'll probably see lots of pictures on there. And you will find Moon Maiden on Instagram as well, guys. I think they're on Twitter as well. They're everywhere. And you know what? I'm glad because what they do is amazing. I look forward to seeing more spoofy pictures. I hope, I think I did well, guys. Do you think I did well? Pop a comment on below and tell me what you think. All right, guys, take care of yourself and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Bye for now.